Hey, hey, hey guys, it's Old Man G here back again with another video for Red Devil Studio. And um, wow, um, this is probably the first and probably last transfer I'm going to make before the transfer deadline. Um, it's Sergio Ramos to Manchester United because, quite frankly, we're not going to be making any January transfer windows, a uh, trans transfer. Sorry. Um, this is coming from the Daily Mirror, so I'm already quite suspect. But before we get into news, if you're new to the channel, remember to like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio. Follow us on Twitter, Tonight X, and smash the notification button for latest Manchester United news, guys. Um, yeah, Ramos to Manchester United, man. Um, this is so coming from the Daily Mirror. Um, really, I, mean, I always try to look for sources where these guys are quoting from. Really, all it is, just scroll down to the bottom here. Um, Ramos Camp, however, expects to target United first amid rumors that Old Trafford is the defender's first choice destination. United have shown by sign 33 year old Esson Kwan that age is no bad. Ramos, who, who heard all about life at United from Dave Beckham, and Pendant Mudgett would much bring needed experience to Solskjaer's back line. So basically, we're going by the fact that it isn't now. We've been burned by Ramos before, um, you know, trying to basically get Madrid to get a new contract. The reality of Madrid here is that Madrid only really want to offer Ramos, who's, I think, 34, 30, 35, a one-year extension on the way that he has. Ramos wants a two-year, um, and he's willing to reject this, this one-year extension. And Madrid are holding firm for obvious reasons because for lack of COVID, etc. cetera. Um, therefore, this is putting a lot of teams on alert. The reality is that he would be still be needing 200K. And so, yeah, the fact is, even if this isn't true, Manchester United would have to be in a race because Manchester United are probably the only team that would be willing to pay 200k plus a week for a 34 year old that's the reality city are not going to do that liverpool are not going to do that tottenham are not gonna, no other team in the premier league is really going to do that maybe arsenal would um for branding purposes chelsea mm, i don't think would do that so really it's, it'll be only arsenal united in the premier league psg might so whether he'd be into going to psg that's another thing but even them i think are starting to move away from this this model um so, you know, if we are, if United are interested in getting Sergio Ramos um, to sort out, but I don't think it's a long-term solution. I think there are other better options, like Diaz was an option that we were interested in. We didn't go for him, and you can see what's happened. We've effectively handed Tilly the title by not going for that option. He was available. We didn't. Um, Sergio Ramos, you know, it'd have to be a similar situation to Cavani, you know, where, and even with Cavani that this article mentioned, we actually gave Cavani a one year with option to extend. So if we're going to do that for Sergio Ramos, then I think that's it have to be the similar thing. And he's older than Edison Cavani. And whether Sergio Ramos will be happy with such a deal, one year with option to extend on 200k a week remains to be seen. I don't think it will solve our defensive issue in the long term. And obviously, you know, will it be able to do it? Because Sergio Ramos is not that quick. You've got to remember this. Like, like he's 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 got good leadership skills. He's, his position awareness is, is okay. Um, and he can score goals, you know. So he's a certain defender who can score goals. But he's not actually that quick. And his art of defending sometimes can be a bit suspect. But we'll see what happens. Anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, to like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio. Follow us on Twitter, United X, and smash the notification button for latest Manchester United news. Have a nice day, everyone. And cheers.